Hello, hello, Facebook friends, I made it, we're live. This is Colleen Winia, Reset Your Vibe Success Coach, working on getting her Wi-Fi to cooperate. <laughs> so, very interesting, because today's, um, we're just gonna, you know, see who's gonna join us here. But we're gonna do a short little uh, Facebook training segment. I haven't, a, a share really, something I haven't um, had time to, to get on, because there's a lot of changes going on in my life. And so I thought, what better thing to talk about than changes, right? So change is rarely, rarely, rarely easy. And um, wait to know who's, what. oh yeah, swipe left to see. Okay, very cool. Very interesting. Um, not sure what this is doing here. There we go. Anyways, I'm just checking out some um, little uh, functions on my phone here. So if you're just joining or you're going to be joining, Colleen Winnie of ColleenWinnie.com and I'm here to just give you a few tips today on change. Change is rarely easy, but it's so worth it. It's so worth it. And what I mean by that is um, big changes. Big, 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 big changes where you are allowing in great opportunities to come into your life. That's what never feels easy because the struggle is like right there. So are you a coach? Are you a consultant? Are you a network marketing professional? You know, do you feel overwhelmed? You know, does, does uh, change stop you in your tracks? I mean, it has for me. And so I wanted to jump on here to share... Um, just some things to uh, real short to help you through this transition so it doesn't feel good but it's totally possible so just a little uh, like the reason I'm doing this is because I've not had the space to do a training for the last few weeks uh, appropriately I've not I've had all this change going on in my life and it feels so overwhelming in my body so unsurmountable and yet we know that it's actually stretching me um, and the people in my life to have a better life and all the people that I influence. So as I grow and as I stretch, then, then you've got, you know, you've got someone here that has been through it. Um, you, you get the experience so that you are here to thrive, right? Because you have some things that you want to do. So thanks for joining us, Cheryl. Thanks for joining us, Felita. Um, we're just talking about change here and that it's so worth it when there's something big that's happening and you want to create uh, that transition. Um, so I want to talk to you about three things today that can help you through change and uh, dealing with the struggle. So you want to be authentic. Um, don't worry about being perfect. Be authentic. We're going to discuss delivering value, um, sharing your wisdom with the world and your family. And we're going to talk about <clears throat> staying committed. So following through. So this is my tips today is be authentic guys. Be in your heart. Right? Because you know, we try to hold it all together and look like we have our, you know, our shit in, the, in a row, excuse my French. And, you know, if you're in network marketing or if you are a consultant or you're an entrepreneur stretching and growing to the next level in your business, you're going to die. You know, we all know change is um, the only thing that's guaranteed in life is transition. And so it's how you deal with it. And I want you to breathe into it. I want you to allow it to unfold. I want you to create space in your life so that you're feeling loved and supported. Right, so collect your tribe, collect your tribe of people. I'm one of those people as a Reset Your Vibe Success Coach. I help my clients handle change. I help them get unstuck at the cellular level so that they are thriving um, through, once you know they transition through this feeling of this uh, difficult change. And there's some magical ways that I do that. And um, some real tips here for delivering, uh, deliver value. What I mean by that and share your wisdom is all you have to do is tap inside with your expertise. So in your profession, um, it, you know you have this, you have this ability, you have the knowledge, and so it's your job though to step up. It's your job to share that wisdom with the masses um, or with that one-to-one -one person, and it's sharing. It's not telling people what to do. It's literally inviting them to share in um, the gifts that you. have experienced and so I love that the the world and the planet is really opening up because it's through the feeling body okay you can read all the books you want and we do need to do that we need to strengthen our mind but you need to feel your way through it and so that's where you know where things really opened up for me when I finally stopped running from the experience of you know this is just too much this is heavy this is you know um, 
overwhelming me and you just meet it bit by bit by bit because the universe has your back okay God has has your back um, so share and deliver value so whatever your profession is if you're in um, you have a home-based business and you have some you know beautiful products or a beautiful business opportunity speak from your heart share what you do and um, you know that people will be drawn to you or, or they won't be interested and that's totally cool you know you're looking for people that are drawn um, to hear your wisdom that are um, vibrationally attracted to your wisdom right so this is this is about vibrational energy and you deliver value because because you are sharing that which has helped you you know or that which has helped your clients or that which has helped your customers and so really you know be authentic don't worry about being perfect deliver value and share your wisdom and I want you to really really understand about commitment this is one of the biggest things um, um, in my experience as I've been going along it's whenever I have chosen to blame you know sort of even unconsciously blame another or put their responsibility outside of myself um, that's when the problems arise so you want to stay committed to being responsible which means there are things you know you need to do so I just made some notes here on commitment so if you have a network marketing business for example I'm just talking about that because many of you many of you have beautiful home-based businesses of some level and um, one of the things when you commit to using um, oh, this great little hair sticking up there when you commit to um, say using a product that helps you you know it's the duration so when you set uh, people up and help them understand the knowledge behind that you know product that you're dealing with um, then you're educating them right so you're sharing your wisdom and your value and then that's also where you get to you know really remind yourself and remind others that change takes time you know that heart disease you know that heart attack didn't happen overnight or that cancer that's developing which you know if any of you guys are aware um, and tapping in you know Google this but a heart disease used to be the number one uh, killer you know in, in North America and cancer has surpassed you know and I mean part of my struggles I've been dealing with I'm moving um, I had to find a new home I've uh, been looking for a new home uh, for a while and, and found one but it's all coming down the pipeline at the same time um, right so you stay committed to your process so uh, new home, you know, this is a little bit about myself, but new home, and I have a dear, dear friend who's very, very ill in the hospital, and she's been fighting for her life for a while now, and, you know, so my heart was just, I broke, just broke down in tears last night, I was just like, oh my god, you know, struggle, change, I mean, it's not easy, but I know it's stretching me, it's stretching me to be a better person for all of you, it's stretching me to be a better person for myself and my family, and it's, it's helping me um, you know be be that conduit for other people to walk the light to let you guys know that every change is is uh, you know you can look back at all the challenges you've been through and you know when you stay committed to your path right when you stay committed to your heart meaning you listen to your gut and you and listen to your intuition um, if, if you like some help around that, I help you expand in those capacities. Hi Elaine, welcome, thanks for joining as well. I'm just looking at a few names here that have popped on. Um, and also, so talking about commitment, so we were talking about staying uh, with the product so that it actually has a chance to work in your body and in your system. And then if you uh, have a business, for example, and you're a coach, you're a consultant, right? Does one time make everything uh, flip up and everything's all better? You know, no, that's a band-aid approach. And so, you know, I know in my business, uh, people come to me for change, and I, and I find out what is it that you want to change the most in your life? You know, what is it? What is it really that you really want? Is it uh, transition in your relationship, right? With yourself or with your lover or with your family? Um, and Or is it your business is stuck? Or are you just feeling bored? So um, one example, you know, I have a client who came to me and she said, you know, I don't know how to do this, but I know that I'm not, I'm not enjoying life. You know, I'm making good money. I, you know, got a great husband, but I'm bored as heck. And so she didn't know how she was going to do it, but she was committed to her change. And so, um, just a few little tips here today, kind of all over the map. And, you know, normally I'm very organized in my shares and my mind. And today, you know, I, I am feeling all over the map. But and then when I started Wi-Fi and I couldn't get it going, I was like, no, no, I'm going to get this out there just so I can connect with all of you. All right. So take away, um, this is really important because like, 
<sighs> yeah, I just, I just breathe, okay? Breathe. And um, I want to let you know that I'm here for all of you. I continue to help people in their transition of their health. Okay, I work with an amazing company and what not, oh gee, they've gone through change as well, right? They brought um, the mangosteen to the world and this company has merged with another company that has now worked you know, with another beautiful, amazing plant. That's if you type into Siri, you know, what is the most nutritious plant in the world? Um, you can connect with the, the moringa tree. And so, you know, this is huge change coming at the same time. So take it one bite at a time, Breathe your way through it. Stay committed. And those of you who want big change, I invite you to check out my Reset Your Vibe Success program, right? So at the link below, you just reach out to me, private message me, visit my website, send me an email, give me a phone call, my number's there. We'll set up a discovery call and we will work with you, um, free initial discovery call to find out what it is that you're looking, you know, is it healing grief? Is it you've got a health issue? Is it a money problem? Right, and this is all about vibration. So when you are authentic, rather than being wanting to be perfect, through this change, when you deliver value, right, to your, as close to your family, your friends, and your business, um, and you share your wisdom, this rocks. People, um, I myself did not understand the importance of sharing your wisdom because we all think, oh my God, everybody knows that or everyone's heard that before. There's a book out there written on that. There's a YouTube video on that, you know, blah, blah, blah. And yet, you know what? Um, there's somebody there that connects with your energy and how you got to do that is be visible and reach out. So, um, as you can see, I'm going to go and take care of all my, uh, my, uh, things that are all over the map so that I can be aligned uh, for you. I wish you an amazing day, and uh, do reach out and connect for my, my free call to all of you. Thanks for joining. Have a wonderful day. Bye. Hmm. I'm on live still.